before this, there was a lot of rain and now it's very, very, very dry. And during physical education, during classes, everyone's feeling all the heat. Because of that, right, in class I tend to fall asleep more because it's really hot. As a motorbike rider, it's kind of very taxing if I were to ride out in this very hot weather. This dry spell has been great for my plants. My herbs are growing wonderfully. Uh, I take more baths because it's uh, warm. Um, with regards to water conservation, I guess everyone is quite aware of this. And I don't think I've been doing it too actively. I would say that I'm more just if I if I remember it, then I'll do it lah. In Singapore, we are so good. You know, everything is being planned ahead of time. You heard of the new water? You heard of the uh, desalination system? I think this is helping us to a great extent. Basically, what I do is I take short showers, like. Although I'm a girl, but I don't take that long. I take at most five minutes to shower. When I say I'm juicing something, and then when I'm washing, I use the water in the juicer to wash the plants. But it's also to give the plants more nutrients. When you turn on tape, don't turn on to the full. At the beginning, turn slowly. Okay, if it's not enough, we turn some more. The water from the laundry, they can use it to like flush the toilet or something. Yeah. When you brush your teeth, you also don't on the tap. Just use a cup and then just brush it. Instead of using a shower, fill up a bucket, use a ladle and I bathe. I guess it's the, it's the winds, you know, like blowing the clouds somewhere else. Yeah, and then we're left with the sun. I think the, the earth is saying, wake up, wake up! You know, we've got to do something. But what, what we need to do, I think, is, is having more care and concern for the environment and doing what little things that we can to make it a better place for all of us to live.